Hello guys, this is Jerusalem Boom here and welcome to part 5 of Godzilla PS4. And uh, yeah, I'm not looking forward to this one because it had to be Destroyer. Um, I'm expecting him to be giant size, but I'm willing to take that risk, so it may take a bit of a while. But now, let's um, <laughs> destroy the place, shall we? movement in the area. It's Godzilla. How did we let it reach this far inland? Sorry. Now let's tear the place apart. Now, if you guys are wondering why am I skipping a lot of the cutscenes, well, it's due to time constraints because, because because years ago, YouTube used to have a very long video policy, so you don't need to get like a thousand like uh, you like a thousand YouTube subscribers to get longer time. I mean, that's why my Mortal Kombat uh, video from years ago was like a um, a twenty-minute video, or was it thirty-minute? Um, and plus, my stop-motion movies used to be a lot longer than they were. Uh, but now since YouTube's introduced that policy, now it has to be 15 minutes and you have to verify your account. Uh, which of course means revealing your location, which is a big no-no for me in case you've got many nasty copyright people trying to get, trying to um, incinerate your ass with loads of copyright strikes. Uh, a bit of a, um, uh, a nice little novelty thing here, you actually got the uh, Hotel Gracery um, Shinjuku, which is essentially the Godzilla Hotel. Um, I actually seen real videos of that place, and uh, oh, crud! Just look at that thing. Do you mind? I'm trying to show the audience a hotel here. Buzz off! Yeah, and at night time, that thing will actually do um, an atomic breath um, at, to at Tokyo. So it's like a really cool place. But uh, I wish I could go there, but I don't have the money to go to Japan. See, this isn't too bad. Just like in Guzzle Destroy Monsters Melee, that move up here, that sword is so annoying. Um, but here it's like not totally as bad, but but it comes pretty close. I meant pretty close. Oh, I was so close. Come on, let me live. Oh. No, you don't. Destroya has gone down. Now that Godzilla has defeated his enemy, he's sure to turn his attention to the generator. Jeez, what a buzzkill. It's so musku. Yeah, yeah, da, 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 Okay, I just had to get that out of my system. Alright then, let's uh, destroy the rest of Tokyo. Like I said in the previous part, guys, um... The only forgettable bit about this game has to be the music. While it is actually kind of good in some of the areas, but 
it feels like very generic it does but when you get like the military and when they start playing the actual music from the films then it sounds absolutely great for it like hearing the uh, Ifkiri Fakube um, army march um, which is very fitting and also the main Godzilla theme tune that plays in the main uh, in the main intro as well as the end credits god I was actually amazed I even hit that while they do play like other themes too, they even play the G-Force theme when you get more higher in the um, in the disaster level at the bottom. Uh, as for what's coming up guys, I know you guys have been impatient with the World of Tank videos lately, but I do assure you that I am still currently working on the Godzilla vs. Evangelion movie. Um, uh, I'm planning to have a video coming up mainly updates uh, uh, to explain what happened so far is um, uh, I've been really preparing myself to do the movies um, uh, Godzilla vs. Evangelion um, I essentially, well I got Shin Godzilla recently on Blu-ray for Christmas and, uh, and you guys know I absolutely love the movie and I find it a very unique change of pace of course I have prepared myself before seeing Shin uh, because I decided to watch the Evangelion movies first because since they are directed by the guy who did Evangelion, Haikiki Yano um, who is also an animator for, um, for uh, uh, Studio Ghibli and I believe he does pop on with them from time to time uh, his first like major work was um, animating the warrior in, um, in I think is it the great warrior in Nausicaa the Valley of the Wind in uh, 1982 the movie or was it 1980 um, I can't remember the exact um, film year for it but uh, yeah he was known for doing that and then he's done so like uh, other bits of work at Guy Next Studios of so the people who later made Evangelion uh, yeah so the first film I decided to start out with was recommended by brother known as Google Man 5 um, is uh, Evangelion 1.0 You Are Not Alone uh, and then worked on with the sequel You Cannot Advance which is Evangelion 2.22 but I yet to see the third one being 3.33 um, uh, but of course then I decided to delve into the other Evangelion films being Death and Rebirth which is essentially a compilation of uh, the Evangelion television episodes um, uh, 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 of, of course it has um, the death segment essentially the recap episodes but Rebirth is pretty much a 13 minute um, preview of the next film being the end of Evangelion uh, which that one I actually do really like the most uh, but that's how far I got with the Evangelion stuff because I would get the entire series on DVD but due to poor uh, availability in the UK by Manga Entertainment um, they're out of print and very expensive. I've tried constantly to um, uh, say, uh, dude, please re-release them. Uh, well, of course, they're not really responding back. Of course, I did kind of um, bug them of doing um, Shin Godzilla, which of course they eventually did, um, which is amazing. So uh, there's that. Of course, I've cons of course, um, a few viewers may know that I have. Uh, uh, you, uh, customize my own Evangelion um, figure to go along with my shin uh, which is essentially a Spider-Man Miles Morales figure um, because I can't really afford a Evangelion figure at the moment of course I built my own angel and I've done three posters which you can find on my Twitter Where is Godzilla heading? of course we'll do these two next time uh, so I hope you guys enjoyed the uh, part as well as listening to the update of Gazel vs. Evangelion. Um, so I'll see you guys next time for part 6.